everybody. Today we are going to make juk. It's a swegogi yacheju. Juk is porridge, usually made with rice. Swegogi yacheju is made with beef and colorful vegetables. This is one bowl meal. You don't need any other side dishes. Of course, if you have kimchi, it's good. I'm going to make four servings today with one cup of rice. Let's start. I just use this kind of colorful vegetables, bell peppers, and broccoli. You know, broccoli is very nutritious. Carrot, onion, you know, garlic, and beef. One cup of rice. Let's wash this. In cold water, pour out this milky water and just grab this. Scrub like this. Just rinse a couple of times until the water is clear. We are going to soak this rice at least 30 minutes. This rice is already 30 minutes ago. I soaked this. Any lean cut of beef is good. So this is beef shank, half a pound. And then I will just use my food processor. And, but you can use ground beef. And I'm going to Grind this. Oh, look at that! Like make one bowl. Four garlic cloves. I always start with the garlic, eh? Yeah? Isn't it? Means and less onion about this. Chop into really small pieces. this amount. All ingredients, let's chop it up really into small pieces because this is porridge. So we need to really easily, you should be able to chew or just almost you don't have to chew. Like easily you can swallow. That's the point of porridge. And then the yellow bell pepper. And red bell pepper. All these colorful vegetables, so whatever you have in your fridge, use this. You can use spinach, you can use other types of whole vegetable, even mushrooms. Broccoli. I washed this already. And then let's just also chop it up. Broccoli is around one and a half cup amount. And all these just small pieces, we all use this. All the cutting is done. Beef and vegetables and rice soaked 30 minutes ago. So let's strain this. Let's cook. Sesame oil. Round two teaspoon, and then ground the beef. Mm -hmm. 
So here I find this have uh, this is a uh, mustard. I take it off. This beef is no longer pink. Add garlic and onion. Until this onion looks translucent, it takes around two minutes. Let's add rice. Stir this around two or three minutes until this rice is also half translucent. Now it's a little like translucent, isn't it? Yeah, clear. It's time to add all vegetables. Oh, nice. So let's add water. Seven cups of water. Just well stir this on the bottom. Sticky kind of rice is all mixed. Okay, and then cover. And boil. 쇠고기 야채주 has a lot of good memories for me because a long time ago. I was living in America, 1990s. At the time, I was living with my family. And then my father was sick. Really, he had a huge major surgery in Korea. And I just, uh, I had to go there to see my father. My father really missed me. I found out that, you know, my mom makes that all kinds of food that doctors said that you should not, uh, you shouldn't use the salt, you shouldn't use this, you should, you make that, you know, seven, eight different kinds of grains, make rice, certain food he, he. Oh, wow, it's a boil over. Stir this, and then, like this. Turn down the heat to low. There are not many things he can eat, and then, I just made this porridge, and also I made bibimbap, so two uh, kinds of food I made this. This porridge is like, a, I really wanted to make a special food, very, very nutritious, like a protein, lots of protein plus mineral vitamins. I went to market by myself and they pick up the really lean cut of beef, best cut of beef. Came home and then I, I just chop it up with my knife. All my energy, just uh, father, please, you should survive with this, recover quickly. My father really, really liked it. So he loved my food. Now no, I can't see him anymore, but always like uh, whenever I got an email from my readers, you know, they just asked me, oh, Mangchi, my mom is really sick right now, you know, I don't know what to cook. I always give them this direction. So some of you guys already heard this from me. See, rice is all done, right? And then, but I like to cook just a little longer. Turn down the heat, low heat. So this is kim seaweed paper. I'm going to make a crushed seaweed paper. Serves for for each one you use this one sheet of kim. So I will use fish sauce. You could use salt or fish sauce, but I prefer fish sauce because it has like a better flavor. Two tablespoons. Wow, a lot amount. It will be enough for four large bowls. One teaspoon sesame oil. And then this kim, you make this kim, crush the kim, and then give it to them on top. Okay, here, here is you for you, like this. Mm. Mm. 
delicious. A lot of beef, so make broth tasty. And also gim, the seaweed paper, the gim flavor is really good. This is really hearty and comfort food. This is also good food for babies. Today, we made suegogi yacheju, porridge made with beef and vegetables. Enjoy my recipe. See you next time. Bye.